Uh, this is the La Casa del Habano at Almere, which is just outside Amsterdam. We've come this evening. Um, we've got the old Cuban flag are waving. Uh, nice mat. We've got people smoking in here. We've got lots of. The only thing I'd say about it is it's a little bit bare at the moment, but I think it's just open. So, anyway, so there's a nice foyer area. There's a smoking area there, and it goes downstairs as well. So, what we'll do is we will go in there, which is the middle. See you in a bit. So, this is the La Casa del Habano in Almere, in Holland, which we've come to uh, on our little Dutch trip. They're doing some aged cigars here. So 2007 Secretarials, although they'd probably be plugged. I've had loads of them that are plugged. Vintage number twos, Trinidad's, some regional Beneluxes, some limiteds, all sorts of stuff really. But yeah, it's just the Payol Barriols, I can't say them, the, this year's regional. Uh, a very nice set of humidor, the jars. So we've got lots of Monte Cristos, two shells of them, Cohibas in this little corner, so we've got Siglo series, Robustos, uh, Exquisitos, Hatellas, Splendidos, well, only one of those little uh, pyramid extras left. On the bottom here we've got some Paula Ranagar, Upmans, a jar of Noellas, um, oh, I forgot. More Rutmans. Yes, yeah, so this is a really nice walking humidor. It's very airy and spaced here. We've got some little section of Pity Robustos. You get a Cohiba in that one. Uh, that I don't, and a Partagas. I don't think they do those separately. So. so there we go. We've got some El Rey del Mundo's punches. Uh, they've got all the Anejo range, uh, the aged that haven't really had that good a reception I think, some Partagas series, uh, Lusitania's, Presidentes, some Romeos and then he's got some jars at the top here, I don't think they're all personal issue, got a P2 jar there, oh sorry, no, P1 jar there, yeah, so, Noella jar, whatever. <laughs> Uh, some La Casa re uh, releases, so you've got the Liberator Door, whatever you call it, the Royal Robusto, only one of them left, but there's some boxes. Um, what have we got there? Deluxe. Oh, Epica Deluxe, Deluxe. the Romain one is Limited. Shame they haven't got any part of this, uh, what was the Limited, the uh, Provada, the bought box of them. <laughs> Depends how much they are, Gav. Uh, got some QR hoppers, the diademo, which my friend Gav said was uh, shit, but I want one because it's interesting looking. Yeah. And then we're going to the cheaper end of Cuban Ceremones. There's Gavin looking at boxes of uh, Ross. We've got Vegaros, Piedras, awful, and some other sort of more machine rolled cigars. We've got some nice looking humidors. And there we go. So, some jars stacked up there, and as you can see, it's lovely airy humidor here, and some old-looking Vegros. <laughs> yeah, this fancy Paul Arangagar Robusto Superior. Some La Cetion, Italian regionals, and the new um, well, Capuletta. Yeah, not bad, 18 euros. Capiletos. Capiletos. Romeo and Juliet. Yeah, uh, and Gab's got himself a little box of them in there. Uh, but here we are. That's very nice here. They've got a lovely smoking lounge. And so up the top here, smoking area up the top, and then down in the basement, they've got another one. So this is Almere, just outside of, um, of uh, Amsterdam. As a reprobate in his tie. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this humidor tour. And uh, prices in Amsterdam, pretty good. Pretty much half of what they are in the UK. Uh, let's just have a look. 
So, Hardegas Series P number two, 13 euros 50. Um, D4, 10 euros. A lot more in the UK. Uh, what else have we got? That's, anyway, that's probably enough for now, so I'll uh, see you later. Part of the video, here we go, here's the lounge area. Nice upstairs lounge. And then you go down the steps. And massive basement with a pool table, a bar. Obviously this isn't quite finished. There's a personal humidor there as well. Okay, so there we go. The La Casa at Almir in uh, Holland. So, just uh, come up again. There we go. So there's the walk-in. With more people keep buying stuff. It's quite late here. I open late and uh, back out into the foyer area. There we go. Anyway, see you around.